Hey, what's up everyone? This is your boy James and I am back with another video for you, for you guys today. And today I just want to do like a quick astrological forecast of, you know, for September of 2024. So like when it comes to with what's happening in the planets, especially when it's relating to astrology and just like when I get like a, you know, like a heads up what's happening in the planets right now, what positions they're, they're in and so on and so forth too when it comes to with this video and just really, you know, checking it out and, you know, when it comes to with, you know, what's happening in the current planets right now, especially for September. There's some pretty interesting changes coming along too. So like when it comes to with the sun being in Virgo and the new moon in Libra also too, it's a really powerful time to just, you know, to just really, you know, to reflect on things and also to just to, you know, take it, take it, take things a little bit easy, but also focus on stuff that's really important too. Cause like in the Mercury and Leo, it's just like, you know, it's in Leo. So it's kind of like a lot of, passionate energy there too, especially when it comes to communication. And same goes to Venus also too, which is in Libra. And you know, and Mars and Jupiter is in Cancer and Gemini too. So it's a lot of interesting stuff there relating to what's happening in society and everything else. And Saturn and Uranus and Neptune and Pluto are still in retrograde. So a lot of powerful stuff is still happening, but also too, like, you know, some things are a little bit different in the current planets, but you're got, you guys are more than welcome to just, you know, share your own feelings and thoughts if you get something different. Also, because, you know, when it comes to, you know, what's happening in the current planets, you know, especially around September, you know, some things could change too. So, like, you know, what planet could be another, you know, uh, position or transit and so on and so forth. So it's kind of like, you know, you know, recording this video too in early September, you know, things might change too down the road for the next few weeks. So just again, for anyone who is into astrology, for those who are into the current planets, and especially for anyone who is into just like, you know, astrology and self-care and wellness, just you really, you know, take this video as a reference to just like when it comes to um, what's happening in the current planets, especially in your area too whether you're in the US or if you're, you know, other country too. And also too, like, you know, as a good resource, also if you guys ever want to check out the current planets for yourself, you know, the website that I use is astroseek.com. So if you guys ever want to check that out, it's in the description below. At any time, if you want to just check it out for yourself, if you want to just check out the current planets, especially in your area too, just to really get a glimpse of what's happening, you know, what's happening, uh, what's happening <laughs> in the current planets too, when it comes to, you know, with the new moon and with the sun placement and with, you know, retrogrades that are happening too, if it's Mercury or if it's Saturn, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Just feel free to share your own feelings and thoughts at any time, especially if you're watching this video too. But also too, if I want to share something with you guys, see if you guys, anyone is open to just oracle readings and tail readings. Yeah, for me personally, I like to use oracle cards, you know, just like when it comes to you, just share some powerful messages relating to this video also. And if anyone resonates with these messages also at any time, you're more than welcome to share your own feelings and thoughts at any time. If one message or two of them or all of them resonate with you too just feel free to share your own feelings and thoughts at any time you're more than welcome to just you know share your feelings and thoughts you know in the comment section if you get anything different when it comes to you with the current planet in transit position in september when it comes to what the current what the current planets are right now too when it comes to with that astro with the astrology chart that i just shared earlier too so like you know when when it comes to what the first message too that i want to share with you guys too is just really all about light and so like when it comes to light and that's kind of like a beautiful word but also to you know suggest should ugh, i always say suggestive if i'm saying that right correctly too suggest subjective but also too like when it comes to with light it's like a beautiful way for all of us to, to just really be gentle with ourselves. And like, if you see in, the, in this powerful healing message right here too, when it comes to with that, you know, 
the heart shape kind of like symbol here too it's kind of like you know when it comes to with ourselves too because you know our hearts were home is where our heart is too if you heard that kind of old saying before and just really taking the time for ourselves to so just really being gentle with ourselves too to really just not be our own worst enemy you know or just like when it comes to not being so hard on ourselves if we're going through certain challenges or if we're going through any kind of challenges also just really taking the time for yourself to just really being gentle with yourself and really just really doing that in a really powerful way too that can really that can really just bring some clarity towards yourself also too in any shape or form too however you guys want to just bring you know bring some gentleness for yourself and just really being not so hard on ourselves too in a really powerful way as well and when it comes to with the second message is really all about individualization and kind of like with, when it comes to with this divine feminine message here too it's really all about independence so it's kind of like you know connecting with your independence in your own unique way especially towards yourself too in a really powerful way as well as can really just be helpful so like when it comes to it for the month of september when it comes to with the astrology chart as well, just really taking the time for yourself to just really connecting to your independence and just really doing that in a really powerful way too. If you have any kind of goals that you want to set for yourself when it comes to, you know, whether it be, it could be anything, going back to school, getting a new job, or just like, you know, with anything, just really connecting with your independence and really just doing that in your own unique way, whether you're a man or a woman can really just be helpful especially towards yourself also too when it comes to with this message right there too and with the last message i want to share with you guys too when it comes to with the divine masculine message is just to really you know get things in order too when it comes to with the organization card and this is a really powerful message for any of us too especially you know when it comes to with the with the divine masculine message is just really getting things in order that are just really important to us too so whether it could be just like our education for our health it could be both or vice versa whichever anything that's really important to us when it comes to what you know when it comes to our overall health and what's you know uh overall it's for our overall health basically too if i'm <laughs> you know saying that right too and let me see if i could put this these cards in position again too so you guys can really just uh, see them so it's kind of like you know when it comes to with individualization or i see organization too you know it's just a really powerful way for all of us to really just take action to just really get things in order that are important it can be our health it can be our career our education you know or all the above too so like when it comes to anything that's really important for us especially for our overall well-being whether it be for our health for our career goals etc too just really focus on that really getting things in order too when it comes to with anything and even anyone that's really just important too so just really getting things in order too and just really organizing that in a really healthy way too and using your masculine energy to do that can really just be helpful along the way especially how you want to apply that you know in your own unique way too when it comes to with this powerful message right here too and just like you know all these three cards together it's just like being gentle with yourself and connecting with your independence and just really getting things in order it's a really powerful way for any of us whether you're a man or a woman if you're straight if you're gay how you want to identify yourself just really taking the time for ourselves to just really focus you know that's just really important just really being gentle with ourselves and connecting with our independence and just really getting things in order in our own unique way too to help us to just really move forward you know in the month of september as well so like with all being said with that being said too hopefully this uh this video has been really helpful for you especially for anyone who is watching this in the morning in the afternoon or in the evening and much love to all you guys too who are watching this video as well if you guys have any kind of questions that you want to just share when it comes to with the astrology current planet uh chart too from astroseek.com and even just like when it comes to 
with these messages as well too. Just feel free to share your own feelings and thoughts at any time as well too. Especially when it comes to with these messages, but also too with the, you know, the current planets, you know, during the month of September too. So feel free to just share your own feelings and thoughts at any time. Because, you know, with the current planets, it could change, you know, like the next day too. So it's like, hey, you know, it's always good to just check here and there just to, you know, get a good glimpse of what's going on in the current planets as well. And just really, you know, taking that, you know, towards you, you know, taking that to heart, taking that to your mind and your body in, in your own way as well too. So with that being said, um, hope you guys are taking care of yourselves and doing well and thriving in life and I'll just really do my best to make more videos like this, you know, on a regular basis too, because, you know, I'm at my hands full too when it comes to certain things I'm about to do too. So it's kind of like, you know, for the things I'm about to do too, especially, you know, that's outside of social media, like on YouTube and Instagram is going to take a lot of my time, but I'll make sure to make more time for you guys to just really make more content like this on a regular basis, especially when it comes to with self-care and wellness, how you can really just apply that to your everyday life too, especially you know, towards yourself, for your body, for your emotions, for your mental health, and especially in your relationships too with life, with yourself and other people in your environment, etc. etc. So huh, with that being said, I am about to um just wrap up this video too, making sure I, I always like to um get these make these cards kind of like organized too so this really if you guys can see them as well feel free to like you know that's kind of like my OCD kicking in too so I can't help myself sometimes when I you know shuffle cards especially from different decks and I try to line them up too it always kind of you know um looks <laughs> looks different so um hopefully you get the gist of what I'm what you know these messages first are saying for you too especially when it comes to with this video as well so um with uh with that being said i'll share these messages one more time so you guys could you know get an understanding of it too when it comes to with the uh, uh with this video of for the month uh, for the astrology month of uh for the ash for the astrology um current planets of of September of 2024 so damn that was a lot to say for you know for a video too so like when it comes to you with this message just really being gentle with yourself when it comes to with the first message and to connect with your independence when it comes to with the divine feminine message here too and that's in the middle and it's really using our masculine energy to just really you know getting things in order too when it comes to with those certain desires and goals that are really important too like for our overall health and education for your career etc etc even in our relationships too with ourselves and other people as well so again feel free to share your own feelings and thoughts at any time feel free to share this video that could really just be helpful especially for anyone who is into astrology and for those who are into oracle readings as well even tarot readings too feel free to share with anyone that can really just be helpful too and yeah with that being said i am about to wrap this video up much love take care and many blessings